deuce per company is just a little bit different. Okay, so this is going to come to a boil and I'm going to reduce it to the simmer and then we'll move on to the next step of cooling the couscous. Okay guys, this here is the cooked couscous and I've spread it out over a baking sheet to let it cool because I don't want to create the salad while this semolina is hot. Okay. Uh, this is going to take about 10 to 20 minutes to cool to a room temperature sufficient. And then I'm going to add this to the couscous dressing that I made earlier. And then we're going to set the whole concoction aside and we're going to grill up some sash lake. So stick around and I'll see you in a little bit. So I allowed the couscous to cool for about 30 minutes and then I mixed it into the dressing in this bowl and here it is. Now sometimes you'll experience that as the couscous cools, these delicious little pellets of semolina are going to stick together. But once you add it to this dressing, they become all nice and separate, see? And all these flavors, the tomatoes, the calamata olives, okay, the chili, salt, pepper, cilantro, mint, all these flavors are going to marry and the semolina is going to absorb it. I'm going to let this salad sit now for about another 30 minutes and suck up the flavors of this dressing and then we're going to grill some meat. Oh yeah, let's get it on. Let's start grilling some shashlik. This here is a wonderful little indoor grill that I bought. It comes from Korea. It's great for yakitori cooking it's great for indoor grilling. This is the best grill I have ever had for indoors. Those contact grills I've had in the past are junk. This is a serious grill. I've clocked this grill at over 550 degrees if you need. So let's make some shashlik. Now this skewer has the beef and in between the beef I'm separating with candied ginger instead of mushroom, onion, or tomatoes, okay, I'm using candied ginger because I happen to like candied ginger. So on these two skewers, I'm separating meat with candied ginger. And on this skewer, in this skewer, I'm just doing beef. Can you hear that sizzle already and see that smoke? Man, this is just a fantastic grill. And I'll probably leave a link to this product in my description. Look at this thing go, man. It's smoking already. Okay? I might have to reduce the heat because I don't need this to cook at 500. So, I'm going to grill up this shashlik and we'll...